convert the .jpg files we sent you into the .mp4 files to go onto your menu screens. You're going to need a free piece of software from Microsoft called Windows Movie Maker. Um, if you haven't got it, you can simply go to Microsoft.com and look for Windows Movie Maker and you'll be able to download it for your version of Windows. Uh, Mac has a similar version. Once you have the piece of software loaded up on your screen, uh, you'll see a window something like this. And the first thing that you need to do is to uh, add a picture. So click there to add the picture. Go to where you've uh, um, downloaded our files. So this is Arthur's, uh, so I'm going to call this the Big Taste Board. Just find that. Big Taste Board and open that folder. Takes a moment or two. Now, specifically, if you're using the Big Taste Board, you'll need to make certain that it is orientated in the correct position. Um, have a look at which uh, direction the bottom of your screen is and rotate it accordingly so that it fills the screen. Now, once you've done that, you can click it and you can go to Edit. Uh, a typical duration for any of the screens is uh, uh, 900 seconds. This gives you 15 minutes before it loops around. So go to duration and type in 900 seconds and you'll then see that it fills the screen. Once you've done that, we're ready to render the movie file. So click uh, to the left there and save the movie for high definition display. Okay, so this is going to render out in MPEG-4 or H.264 and the important thing to look for is the .mpeg4 codec there. Uh, give it a name, so we're going to call this Arthur's Big Taste. And then we just click save. So this saving process will take some time, we'll come back in a moment or two when it's done. Once the file has rendered, you should see this little dialog box appear on your screen. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're just going to play that file, so see what it looks like. And you can see that it's just a, a full screen file, which is orientated. Uh, looks a bit wrong at the moment, but obviously what we're going to do is put it on the screen and the screen will be orientated to make it correct. What we're going to do is navigate to where we've saved that folder. Uh, let's just see where I actually saved that. So you can just have a quick look to see where I saved it. So it's on my desktop. And uh, we've called it Arthur's Big Taste. So here it is here. And now we can just send that to um, the uh, USB drive where we want to, get to uh, keep it. OK, I hope this video helps you. If you have any problems, you can email me at tonym at fast-food-systems.co.uk. Give me a call or Skype me. I look forward to hearing from you. Thank you. Bye-bye.